Marseille on France's Mediterranean coast. In a studio on the edge of town, a band whose members are drawn from Eastern Europe and Algeria are singing a song in Hebrew about immigration appropriate for a town where the mix of languages and cultures has been going on for centuries. It's been a fertile melting pot for artists and it's helped give Marseille the most important music scene in France. It reflects a whole generation of people like me who are in Marseille and come from a variety of different backgrounds and who want to express that, but who want to do it in their own way, not the way their parents did. So I think it's about showing multiculturalism as it's experienced by a new generation. But multiculturalism and immigration are deeply controversial in modern France. In the run-up to presidential elections, President Sarkozy's party has vowed to cut legal immigration in half. Much of the debate is set by politicians even further to the right, like the National Front Party. Laurent is standing for them in legislative elections here. He's actually the son of immigrants himself from Italy and Spain. He says immigration nowadays is very different. Why? Because of religion. D'ailleurs, je crois que le mot racisme est, euh, est un peu disproportionné. Je crois qu'il y a une. I think the word racism is somewhat out of proportion. D'origine européenne. I think there's an animosity from French people of European origins or of native French stock towards newly arrived French people who demand halal meat in school canteens, who call for wearing the burqa, etc., etc. Qui qui exige le port de la burqa, etc., etc. Voilà. Critics say the far-right attacks on immigration are often just a veiled form of Islamophobia. But the relative popularity of the National Front here has made this part of mainstream political debate in France. Meanwhile, Muslims in Marseille, some of whom have been here for several generations, say they're still at a disadvantage finding work or being allocated housing in certain parts of town. This centre sells specially subsidised groceries to Muslim families going through hard times. Far from being a group apart, they say their concerns are the same as any other Frenchman's. On a l'impression quand on entend les politiques ou les décideurs, alors quand on parle plus particulièrement. You get the impression when you listen to politicians and decision makers talking about Muslim families that they get up every morning with three objectives for the day: wearing the burqa, praying in the street, and eating halal. Well, that might sometimes be part of what some families are asking for, but I can tell you that in daily life, what people are worrying about is their purchasing power and safety. Au quotidien, les gens ils ont des préoccupations de pouvoir d'achat et de sécurité. Marseille is a microcosm for France's immigration debate, but it's an issue presidential candidates are playing on across the country. All eyes are on how multiculturalism works here to see if France will choose to view Marseille as an example of what to avoid or a model for other French towns to follow. <laughs>